Somebody look at your neighbor and say, she about to bring it tonight. I said, somebody look at your neighbor and say, she about to bring it tonight. Well, we're going to jump right into it because that's how we do it over here. Chucky. These movies we've seen in the past. It's starting to happen now for a time such as this. We thought that shit was just child's play. Uh-uh, that shit is real life. I got a story to tell. And I'm going to tell this story. Because I got something to tell y'all. Something that y'all need to know. That movie Chucky that we seen as kids. That shit happened for real. It's a story. A story called Robert the Doll. And I'm going to make a long story real short. It was a, a maid. She worked for this family. The family treated her like shit. Ordered her to do shit instead of asking her. Y'all know how that shit is. I'm talking about they, they were, the family was nasty to her. But they didn't know that this maid, she knew a little bit of voodoo. I said this maid, she knew a little bit of witchcraft. So what happened was, they fired this maid. Because they said the maid was doing witchcraft in the backyard. So they end up firing this maid. Check it out, it's a true story. So the maid... She said, uh-uh, fuck that shit. She got a doll. She said, I want to get this to your son, to the little boy. She said, I want to get this to your little boy. She gave the doll baby to the little boy. It was a little boy doll baby, about three feet Little boy took the doll. Everywhere he went, he took that doll. What happened was, the doll started doing shit around the house. So the mama thought it was the little boy doing it. And she like, motherfucker, did you break this glass? He like, nah, I ain't do that. It was the doll. So her, thinking, oh no, no doll can't do this. That's not possible. Not knowing the spiritual realm. She like, oh no, I know you broke this glass. So she going off on the little boy. The little boy keep telling her, mama, I ain't break the glass, the doll did it. One day the mama, she walking past the little boy room and she, she hearing the little boy talk to somebody else. Now she know the little boy ain't got nobody else in her room, in his room. So she like, who, who was you talking to? She was like, he said, I'm talking to the doll. But she, she was like, look, I know I heard another voice in here. Who else in here? He said, my mom was just talking to the doll. She brushed it off. Because you know how kids is. When they playing with their toys, sometimes they talk as the other voice. So she left it alone. They go out somewhere. The neighbors and shit. They mowing they line. Sitting on the porch after they got done mowing the line. They see this doll. After they just seen the family leave, they know ain't nobody else there. They see the doll running from room to room, from room to room, from room to room. They seeing him through the window. He coming to the window, running through each window. So they like, what the fuck? So they kept seeing it for a while. So they like, oh, hell no. We got to move away from here. So they end up moving and shit. But they end up seeing it. So the mama. Ain't nobody else home with her. So the mama. She put the doll in one room. Ain't nobody else there, so. She like, look, 
How in the fuck is this dollar just appearing in front of my face like this? And I just, I just put this motherfucker in the other room. After that, she was sold. Instead of just selling the doll or getting it out the house, they locked the motherfucker in the attic. They locked the doll in the attic. Make a long story short. Another family move in the house. They find the doll, the little girl. They had a little girl. She find the doll in the attic. Same shit start happening to her. They were smart because they end up getting the fuck on out. I say that to say this. The movies, that's some real shit. Keep your eyes open. We're going to hear a whole lot about these dolls being haunted. I said we're going to hear a whole lot of stories coming out about these haunted dolls and these baby dolls and these action figures that we buying for our kids. Y'all hear what I'm saying? Shit. Y'all better be careful of these Barbie dolls because y'all don't understand people. They putting rituals and spells, speaking curses and shit over these doll babies and shit. They just think the shit funny. <laughs> we gonna speak this curse over this baby dolls, over this baby doll. We're going to just put it on out and see if we hear a story about it, <laughs> laughing about it. Go to the stores. You buying these baby dolls. Your kids telling you, no, I did not do that. The doll did it. And you whooping the shit out of their asses. Sometimes you got to listen to your kids. Because sometimes it might be some haunted shit in your house. That you bought and you don't even know where you got it from. And you don't even know that it's haunted. You don't know where it come from. Motherfuckers buy statues and shit. And they put it in their house. Check this out. Listen to it, y'all. They be putting statues and shit in their house. Not even knowing where the fuck that shit come from. You just think you decorating your house. Because I do it too. I love to decorate, but you better believe before I put some shit in my house, I always make sure I cleanse that shit. Check it out. Check it out. These voodoo dolls. Motherfuckers think that shit fake. Yeah, right. Huh? Don't let Hollywood fool your ass. I said, don't let Hollywood fool you. That shit is real. I said them voodoo dolls ain't no motherfucking joke. You can take and make a voodoo doll and make that motherfucking voodoo doll go to somebody's house and fuck they asses up while they sleep. You can make a voodoo doll appear in people's dreams and get a motherfucker's nightmares for as long as you want. Oh, I'm telling you some shit I know. Huh. You better be careful what people give you. Because that shit can be haunted. Motherfucker don't like you. I said if a motherfucker don't like you. They can take anything. A goddamn stuffed animal. Put some shit on that motherfucking stuffed animal. And give it to you. And you can't understand. All of a sudden. How your ass having these nightmares. Having these back pains and shit that you ain't never had before till you got that shit in your house. You just wasn't aware of it. Said these voodoo dolls ain't no joke. Motherfucker can make a voodoo doll and come and rape you in your motherfucking dreams. Huh? Motherfucker can make a voodoo doll like a fly on a motherfucking wall. Come back and tell them everything that they want to know about you. Huh, it's all right. Look at your neighbor and say, child's play my ass. I said, look at your neighbor and say, child's play my ass. The shit is real. I said, the shit 
is definitely real. Motherfucker can make a voodoo doll of you. Motherfuckers just laughing, huh? We seen that on TV, yeah. You seen it on TV, bitch. But the shit real, real shit. I'm talking to them motherfuckers, them smart motherfuckers who think basically that the shit ain't going on. And that we just living in a la la land. Huh? Yo, now we living in a magical motherfucker. We just got to know how to open up our ass and see the shit. I'm going to tell y'all again. Look at your neighbor. Say be careful. What the hell you bringing in your house?